Kenya is an African country located on the eastern coast of the continent, bordered by Somalia, Ethiopia, and the Indian Ocean. From its lush forests to impressive mountain ranges, it is a country rich in beauty and geographic diversity. Home to over 41 million people, there are many things that make Kenya unique to other African countries. Kenya has long been a country rich in fossils, including those of our earliest human ancestors. Its modern formation has been marked by bloodshed and rebellion. The Bantus were one of the first groups to migrate to Kenya. Bantu culture most likely reached Kenya from the west and possibly the south sometime between 200 and 1000 AD, having come from Central Africa. From the 8th century onward, the coast was regularly visited by Arabs and Persians who imported glass, textiles and wine, and exported ivory, rhinoceros horn, and slaves. It is most likely that the Arab merchants and native cultures blended to create a new language and distinct community called Swahili. Around the end of the 15th century, the first Europeans set foot on the Kenyan coast. A Portuguese explorer named Vasco da Gama came across Africa's eastern coast while searching for China. The Portuguese stay in eastern Africa for around 200 years, but by the 1700s, they leave eastern Africa and the Arabs seize control. From 1830 to 1890, the slave trade flourishes and they were sold to North America as well as the West Indies. The outcry for the end of slavery was heard from Europe and by 1847, the slave industry within Kenya ends. To governments in the West, Eastern Africa was seen as a land of opportunity. After World War I, the British gained full control over Kenya after being granted it in the Treaty of Versailles. Many Africans did not want to be under British control and were subjected to loss of many tribes because of the colonization. In the early 1950s, Kenyans revolted against the British and European rule in the rebellion called the Mau Mau Movement. This was to remove any European or British influence within the land. Approximately 13,000 people died in this rebellion. Britain sent in troops to control the situation, but soon after declared a state of emergency. And that the Mau Mau group were terrorists rather than freedom fighters. The state of emergency finally ends on November 10, 1959. And by December 12, 1963, Kenya is the 34th African state to gain independence. Jomo Kenyatta is elected prime minister in Kenya's first multiracial elections in May of that year. Around a year later, Kenya is declared a republic. Nzuri sana, wageni, mwakaribishwa, Kenya yetu, hakuna matata.